Mobile phones may cause brain cancer. That's the warning from the World Health Organization after reviewing all the scientific evidence. It's a possible link, not a proven one. But still, it's the first time the WHO's cancer experts have made the connection between wireless devices and cancer. Medical reporter Sophie Scott has the details. Mobile phones are everywhere, but how safe are they and can they cause cancer? Those were the questions pondered by a group of eminent scientists from around the world. After eight days of meetings, they reached a decision. So what this uh, working group has found is a possible risk of uh, cancer in association with the use of mobile phones or cell phones. The panel said some evidence suggested a link between long-term mobile phone use and an increased risk of a type of brain cancer called glioma. The danger of mobile phones has not been definitively proven. On the other hand, it can't be ignored. There were also indicators that some tumours were found on the same side of the head as used for phoning. As a result of the review, the World Health Organisation panel recommends limiting mobile use. There are uh, approaches you can take to, to use texting or to uh, use hands-free systems to reduce or limit your exposure whilst we're in this, this period of uncertainty. Australian experts say the findings are important. Well, I don't think the public should be alarmed, but I think they certainly should be well informed. Industry groups say mobile phones are designed to operate within international and national exposure limits. It's premature to be uh, advising people to limit use. However, we do recognise that some people may be concerned by this debate. And with the uptake of mobile phones and other devices still increasing, scientists admit they still don't know for sure what effect they may have in the long term. Sophie Scott, ABC News.